Whale sharks are the largest fish in the sea. They are also extremely valuable to the marine tourism industry. Over the past four years, we've deployed a number of satellite tags on whale sharks around the bird's head. Unfortunately, most of the tags we've deployed have come off the sharks after only a few weeks to months, which has prevented us from gaining a complete picture of their movements and behaviors. Many researchers have turned to directly fin mounting the tags on the shark's dorsal fins using bolts and rubber washers. While the concept of drilling a shark fin might seem hurtful, in reality there are very few nerve endings in the shark's fin and they do not feel pain at the operation, which is rather like cutting a fingernail to them. In Chandrawasi, we have a unique opportunity to deploy fin mount tags to whale sharks that have accidentally been caught in bogon lift nets while feeding on the small bait fish the nets are targeting. Working with the fishers, we were able to get into the net with five different captured sharks and quickly mount the satellite tags and then release the sharks. They frequently come back to swim around us and continue feeding, a good indication that they are not particularly stressed or traumatized by this operation. Conservation International and our partners such as the State University of Papua have been assisting the Indonesian Ministry of Marine Affairs and Fisheries to learn more about the movements and behavior of the whale shark populations in the bird's head seascape of West Papua in order to better manage these sharks and the tourists that are now flocking to interact with them.